All right, guys, I'm going to walk you through the Hunter EC sprinkler control system or the controller. So first off, uh, come over, set your current uh, time and date. All you do is uh, use the arrow button uh, to cycle through and then your plus or minus button to um, change the time. My, my first one goes over to the AM PM 24 hour clock. And then I got to keep cycling through. So that's how you set it. Program doesn't do anything on this. Next, you got your start times. Um, so right now I got 745. It goes in 15 minute increments if you hit the plus or, or negative sign. Hit the arrow sign and you go through your zones. One, two, three, or four. And then your program mode does um, cycles A, B, and C right over here. So program will always do A, B, and C, and the arrow will always do your zones one, two, three, or four. So once you have your start time set, looks like mine set at 7:45 p.m. Um, we'll do our run time. Right now I got it set for 21 minutes. Again, you can adjust it by hitting the positive or negative buttons. Your arrow will do your zones one, two, three, or four. This is a four zone controller. Then your program mode will do uh, A, B, and C. Um, you can set up three, three cycles a day if you want, or you can set up your different cycles for your different water days. I'll show you down here. Uh, once you have that set, go to your water days. And then you're going to have a circle with a line through it that says it's not going to water that day. Hit your plus or minus, and that will turn those days on or off when that circle removes. Uh, it's a water day. So if you can turn them all on by hitting the plus signs, and then it starts back over, and you hit the minus signs, and it turns it off. So if we want to uh, turn Thursday on, we hit the plus, and it goes over. program will do our bees so cycle a you might be able to water you know monday wednesday and friday cycle b might be on tuesdays and thursdays cycle c might be on saturdays and sundays uh, it's up to you on how you want to set it but again positive negative i'm just going to turn all these off put them back to where i had them all right so now we got all these set up our uh, current date and time, our start times, our run times, and what days we want it to water. Now to um, you just hit it automatic, and it'll automatically uh, start watering on those days. System off if you just don't want to use it. Uh, winter time and whatnot. Now manual all stations. If you go to manual all stations and come back to automatic, it will start cycling all your stations. Oh, I got on zone B. That, that's my problem. So I got to go to zone zone A. So manual stations, back to automatic. See a little sprinkler sign here. It's going to go zone A. And I don't know if you heard it, but my front yard is going off. And then we can cycle through zone 1, zone 2, zone 3, and zone 4. And we turn it off. You leave it on automatic again it will come on automatically on your set uh, water days and water times now we go to manual one station and then all the way back to automatic and now it'll do one station we can do station two it'll run station two and then shut off and go back to your automatic modes all right now seasonal adjust days down here at the very bottom i have it at 130 percent You can adjust your different percentage of how much water, how little water you want, according to uh, what season you're in. So, and that's it. Then you can either turn it off or back to auto and and uh, enjoy your nice green grass and luscious flower beds.